You ready to fight? Ready. Do All right, so here we are in Las Vegas, Nevada, inside the T-Mobile Arena. This has really become the UFC's home base here in Vegas since 2016, and you competed on that in our world fight. UFC 200 was a big one. I got to stand across the octagon one of the greatest fighters of all time, Anderson Silva. But the roof was blown off at UFC 200. So many stars and legends competed on that night. Uh, Anderson Silva gets on his feet. His opponent in a lot of trouble now. That was a choice. Every time he landed that over hand right, he hurt people bad. And this guy has his opponent hurt very badly. Oh, how good is this? One minute into the fight, and we got a full-on bro. These guys said that they were going to... being applied here. All right, so look at that. Cut has been opened around that eye area. He's taking shots over and over again to that area, and now he's dealing with a cut. Good job blocking that shot. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock the guy to that extent, I feel like... Wow! Oh, how good is this? Both men going for the finish. Back to his feet. His opponent's feet on the hips. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. And there you go, again, half guard. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Making all these shots count. Oh, he's setting up for a submission now. That Darce choke is tight. Oh, submission defense on full display there. He said that he was very aware of what this guy brought to the outside of the show in that defense. Attacking on bar. There it is. He's on the arm bar now. Oh, how about that? He gives up on the submission. Look pretty tight to me. He's got to be careful here. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Oh, lands a nice straight. Straight ahead. All right, let us re-rack some replays of the damage done in that round, see if we can isolate the strike that caused the cut. Yeah, a nasty cut opens up when he lands there. It's a beautiful shot that gets to the target. He has not been responsible defensively, and he's really paying for it because now he's dealing with that nasty cut. Ready. All right, round two. Well, this is crazy that this fight is still going. Oh, that's a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up with it. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toe. That'll do oh. it! Oh! Woo! Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. Now Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called to stop in this contest at 23 seconds at round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, 
bad intentions. Well, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and candidly knocking another man out cold. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hope for the knockout, but he was never hopeful. He was sure that he would get it done.